All right, for a while now, fans have been waiting for really any news from the Bills about the ongoing stadium talks, and today we finally got some news. Good evening, everyone. I'm Scott Levin. And I'm Mary Alice Demler, and this is something that goes beyond just fans because it's clear that if and when a new stadium is here, you will be paying for at least part of it. Yeah, to on your side, Steve Brown has the update for us tonight. Yes, the Bills want a new stadium and they'd like a deal put together quickly, as Pagula Sports and Entertainment Executive Vice President Ron Rakuya told WBEN this morning. They also would have liked the conversation to have started earlier. We've been working on this since 2019. Um, it's just come to light now because we've pressed, you know, the urgent button. But we've tried to get, you know, the former administration to engage all the way back to September of 2019. But Rakuya says because of COVID and other reasons, talks with the Andrew Cuomo administration never materialized. Now the job falls to Kathy Hochul and her team. The Bills lease at Highmark Stadium ends in July 2023, but the team would need to play there beyond next season if a new stadium is being built. But says Rakuya. Until we can get, you know, a semblance of a deal and an understanding that we're going to work towards a new stadium, you know, we, we just can't extend the, the current lease that does no one any good. So there is pressure to get a deal done. As has been reported previously, the bills are looking to downsize. Our market analysis shows that, you know, 70,000 seats is too many. Somewhere in the 60 to 62,000 range um, is more appropriate for our market in our historical sales. The, you know, the, um, it becomes very expensive. The last, you know, let's call it five to 10,000 seats that you build into a stadium. Uh, they, they are very cost ineffective. And speaking of cost, Rakuya says the estimate for the price on a 60,000 seat stadium across the street from Highmark Stadium is $1.4 billion. Rakuya says that works for the club financially and notes extras would cost extra. If the state and Erie County prefer a downtown stadium, add a billion to the price tag. Add a dome or retractable roof, add another half billion. <laughs> and yes, the Pagulas are looking for public financing but Rakuya refused to discuss how much. Steve Brown, Channel 2 News.